Hey, what's up friends? Matt here, your value driven coach. And today I'm going to show you how to set up your phone number on Twilio so that it will forward any incoming calls to your desk phone or mobile phone. I've been a Twilio user for a while. I actually use it with my text marketing platform. But one of the things a lot of people ask me is, Hey, is there a way to set it up so that if someone calls my text enabled phone number, it can actually ring to me as well? Because by default, if you were to call your text enabled phone number on Twilio, people are going to hear a message that goes, this is a phone number that is not enabled for voice calling yet. Please go to Twilio and set it up. And that can be quite embarrassing if you're using it for business, especially. So I'm going to share my screen and I'll show you within the next three minutes, how you can set your Twilio phone number up to receive incoming phone calls. Now, first things first, disclaimer, you have to have a Twilio account. If you don't have one, head over to rockstarexpo.com forward slash Twilio. The link will be in the description. Uh, and that way you can sign up for a free Twilio account. You'll also have to pick a phone number on Twilio and make sure that the phone number that you choose is voice enabled, which I haven't seen one that isn't. Okay, now that I got that out of the way, I'll share my screen and let's get started. So when you log into your Twilio console, you're gonna notice this area. You're going to go up here in the search box and type the word studio. As soon as this comes up, you'll click the top link. Now don't get freaked out. You do not have to click, do anything code related. This is going to be the fastest, easiest thing you have learned today. And I'm going to show you how easy it is. You're going to click this plus sign and you're going to name it, uh, incoming call flow. You're going to name it whatever you want, but that's what I'm going to call it is incoming call flow. Now you're going to click on start from scratch and click next. Now this next screen, do not be intimidated. You see this and you're like, oh, what do I do? This is scary. No, it's not. You're about to have a phone number that rings my friend. So over on the right side under voice, you're going to see a thing that says connect call to you're just going to drop it in the middle. Now we have to grab this little thing under incoming call. See the trigger here in Twilio. See, it says incoming call. We want to grab the red dot and connect it to the box. So far, so good. All right. Now click on the box. It'll have a blue line around it. And once that happens, you'll notice that this changed and it says widget name, connect call. Pretty great. Now you have a couple options here. You can have uh, the call connected to a single number, multiple numbers, a whole bunch of stuff. But here's what we're going to do for today's purposes. We're going to do single number. If you click on multiple numbers, you can separate them by comma. Okay, so it's not rocket science here, but under the connect call to single number, there is something you need to know. You have to use what's called the E164 format. Now, don't get scared. What that really means is you just have to put a plus sign in your country code before the phone number. If you're in the United States and Canada where you got a 10 digit phone number, you're going to put plus one and then you're going to put your phone number. So I'm going to put in here uh, very simply, I'm going to put in my business phone, 931-271-5171. Okay. Now that I've got it in there, I'm going to click save. Now you're almost done. You also have to click publish and click publish again. Now, once it says published, you might say, okay, sweet. Am I done? Almost. You're going to go back here and click on your console. Now, when you get back into your console, you have to go to the phone number that you want to have it ring to. So I'm going to go manage active numbers. Now, if somebody calls my toll free number, for example, I'm going to click on my toll free. I want to make it come to my business phone. So you'll scroll down under the voice and fax section. You'll make sure that under accept incoming, it says voice calls under configure with, you want to make sure it says all this stuff with studio flow in it. And then it says call comes in. What do we want it to do? Well, I'm going to pick the call flow. So I'm going to choose the thing I just created called incoming call flow. Now I've created a second flow that says if that one fails for any reason, I'm going to choose the other call flow that I created, which rings to my cell phone separately. But once I'm done, I just hit save. And now my flow is active. And that's literally how easy it is to create it so that your Twilio number rings to your phone. Now all you do is just have a friend or family member or grab a second phone from your spouse, have them call your text enabled phone number and ta-da, it'll ring right to you. That's it. If you need more help with Twilio and cool stuff like text message marketing, get in touch with me and set up a time to have a free consultation. If you look down in the description, you'll see the link to be able to do that. Thanks for watching this video and I look forward to helping you with more.